All right, everybody. So this is going to be different than games, but it is still kind of retro. I don't know. I That word gets used so much. I don't like it so much. Uh, or vintage or classic. I mean, shit, if this is classic, then I'm classic and it makes me sound old, uh, which in some people's eyes I may be. Uh, anyway, we're going to talk about Ninja Turtles today. I've been a Ninja Turtle fan since before I can remember. Uh, bought them, traded them, played with them as a kid, gave them to my cousin. Uh, my cousin and I, that's closer to my age, uh, he and I played with them all growing up. Then I gave them to my younger cousin, and he played with them. And then what was left after the three of us got through with them, my son got. Of course, he played with them. And then, you know, whatever's left, I don't even know what happened. He may have given them away. They may not have made it after four of us. Who knows? <laughs> but... I started picking up Ninja Turtles again. Uh, garage sales, flea markets, things like that. Wherever it's cheap. Um, but I'm anti the new stuff. Uh, of course, I like the old stuff that I grew up watching. Uh, grew up seeing as a kid. Uh, I really quit buying Ninja Turtles probably mid-90s, late 90s or so. When I got more into video games. Which is obviously what this channel is about primarily. Uh, but we're going to talk about Ninja Turtles today. So I like, like I say, the original stuff. Here's Mikey, got the uh, head popping, you know, he ducks down, pops up, you know, pretty cool stuff. Uh, and his, it's in worn condition. I don't want anything, I mean, don't get me wrong, I'd like them sealed, but I'm not going to spend the money on that. Um, I want to see them in played condition. So when I do have grandkids, you know, I have three boys. One's actually uh, going to have a birthday here coming up and he's already married and he's of age. You know, I might have grandkids here in the next three or four years. So I'll have something like this to let them see real toys, not this new junk that comes in a billion pieces. This thing's going to, you know, stand the test of time. So I got Head Pop and Mikey. You know, I like that one. Uh, I picked up this one for parts. It's Raphael. You know, he swings, but he's missing his arms. Uh, I don't even think I paid anything for him. You know, it's one of those that pick up cheap. You know, if I find the arms great. Uh, in fact... I say it looked like they were broke off in there, but they're not. So I got Raph. Got Leonardo here. Looks good. He's the one that the shell opened up on. And I uh, I didn't have the shell. I ordered a big lot off of eBay. That was cheap. Um, had the head pop of Mikey. Had this one. A couple others. I'll show you. It's like 12 bucks or something like that. So really happy to pick that up. Leo was my favorite. I love the color blue. And he was wearing it all the time. So here's uh, Donatello, and he's in a mechanics outfit. I found this one at a flea market actually just a few weeks ago, and uh, he's got this little wrench in his back pocket there. And uh, I think they had like $4, $5, something like that marked on it. So I went and picked it up. I uh, really enjoy that when I can find them out like that. I don't like to just order them. Uh, this Raphael uh, for the spacesuit. Of course, he has a little alien on his back back here, and he's got the hose here in his hand. Uh, this was in that lot. Uh, it's not complete. Most of them aren't. In fact, uh, only one of them has a few little weapons, and I don't even know if they came with it. So picked up that one. Uh, here's the one with the weapons. It's a splinter from the movie, and I don't even know if this is the new stuff, old stuff, or what. Uh, it looks new. It looks too new for me because it has hands that come off, and you know, his hands look really human-like, except for the, the wrinkles. And he's got these little arrows back here in the quiver, and then a belt. I don't know if this is... <laughs> old enough for me to collect and it looks like it's cheap made doesn't even have a date or anything on it i probably won't keep this one then i've got this one's probably my favorite one of what i have i don't have very many leonardo samurai that thing just looks cool uh the classic japanese look uh you know just sweet so it's not the one from the movie but it's very similar then i have have the crazy or the wacky ones. Let's see here. Mike Angela, you know, of course, if, if he had his nunchuck, would spin that thing around like crazy. Pick that one up. And then Raphael, he had something on his back that would turn, obviously. It doesn't have it anymore, but he's pretty good shape overall as well. Then these two are my, probably my oldest and my favorites. So I have a, ah, if I can decide which one I want to show. I have a Hardhead 1988 uh, Donatello here. Uh, he's in good shape. Uh, no major wears, tears. 
a few little scuffs, you know, that's okay, no big deal. And then I got a soft head Raphael. You can kind of see his head getting squished there. And uh, again, he's got a little scuffs and stuff like that. Uh, lighter color green than the head, which I guess is because it's a soft head. I'm not sure. But again, I picked these up new, or uh, not new, uh, used, I mean. Uh, and that's what I like to see. I like to see them out in the wild. So I got those. Now, in that big lot that I bought off of line, I got some of this junk. This is junk. Uh, even as my youngest son was growing up, you know, we watched the TMNT movie and I was like, okay, it's something, you know, it's, it's kind of a happy medium. It's cartoon, but it's not the original cartoons. This is junk. I know it's still Ninja Turtles and it's still getting kids to the Ninja Turtles, but I don't like it. And if I don't like it, I don't collect it. So this kind of stuff will be destroyed in some way, shape, form, or fashion because I don't want to see it in my house. <laughs> uh, but I really will get rid of it. I uh, haven't decided how, whether, you know, somebody's like, Hey, I'll give you some old stuff for it. Okay, cool. Yeah, done. Uh, I've got another one doesn't even have a head on it, uh, that came with the set as well. Um, and I'll get rid of it, like I say, but let me know in the comments, new school, like this old school, like this, or like new, new school, like Michael Bay. They they don't look right to me. They look deformed, more so than mutated, you know. So let me know. Let me know how you feel about Ninja Turtles, and then we've got another video about Ninja Turtles and Power Rangers, because that's a huge rivalry in my house. Just so you know. See ya.